Hey guys, welcome to YS Kong Driving. Today is a very, very special day. It's the 6th of March and this must be the most popular EV that's been launched for quite a while. Just look around us, there's so many people. So I'm sorry, we don't have exclusive uh, viewing of the car. There's going to be a lot of people that's going to get in and out of our view, but never mind. Let's try to tell you a bit more about the car. So the first thing that you want to know about the Omoda E5 is the price. Yes, it's just been launched and the price announcement is 146,800 ringgit. The Cherry Omoda E5 is actually in between the B and C segment. With a wheelbase of 2630mm, it is slightly bigger than the B segment and slightly smaller than the C segment. The nearest C segment uh, SUV in this category would be, well, looking at the Corolla Cross or the CX-30. That one has a wheelbase of 2640. The Honda CRV has a wheelbase of 2700. The HRV, I think, has a wheelbase of 2620. So with 2630 mm, it is just in between the two. So it's, well, nobody says they can't make it in between. Yeah, so this is the size. Now, about this vehicle, it's fully electric with a single motor front wheel drive. And that motor is driven by a 61 kilowatt hour battery. You get 201 horsepower and 340 newton meters of torque. As with most EVs, of course, you get a very nice looking front and you get the Omoda uh, emblem and the wording in the front. And of course, there is no grill. The slats here will open on demand. Yeah, it's controlled by the vehicle. And if it needs to be open for more air, it will open automatically. The charging flap is in here. It's activated by touchscreen on the center screen. So in terms of the lights, they are all LED. So the daytime running lights and the headlamps are LED as are the signal. And you get 18-inch wheels with EV type of uh, rims. Ventilated this in the front, McPherson struts for suspension. And at the back, you get a multi-link arrangement, also 18-inch and smaller uh, single pot caliper and Yes, I think the rear are also ventilated. So along the sides, you get a four-door, five-seater arrangement and the interior is actually really, really nice. You have a choice of all black or this combination, which I like, is actually blue and beige. Okay, so we are told that these are leather. I'm not too sure. In the presentation, they said leather, but I think these are synthetic leather, all right? So you get electrical controls for the driver and co-driver, and seats are ventilated in the front. Sitting in the car is really nice. You get a steering wheel, a little bit bigger than I thought it would be, flat bottom, of course, and you have actually got a wiper and signal controls, and this is the drive, uh, switch here, uh, reverse, neutral, drive and park. Then you have a 24.6 inch large screen, driving information here and your uh, infotainment there with your other settings. This car has got wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. So you don't need to have all those wires connecting it. In terms of the dashboard, it looks really nice. Uh, first, of course, this curved screen is really very, very futuristic. And this wood trim is not really wood, but it looks like wood effect. And you have the aircon uh, louvers here. One, two, three, four. This is a two-zone aircon control. And yes, it has also the aircon uh, vents for the back. So in terms of the driving part is good. And this part here is actually a camera that looks at your face and it tells you, keep your eyes on the road. So they call it eyes on the road. And if you look at say the mirror or your girlfriend or look out too much, it will give you a warning. Uh, 
<laughs> not in so many words, but it tells you, hey, uh, keep your eyes on the road, yeah? It won't scold you, but there's a warning. Okay, so in terms of the trim, it looks really nice. I, I like this color, although there are some people who, who may not like these light colors. They think that maybe they want black, and the option is, yes, you can have it all in black. Ambient colors, uh, you can see here, ambient light here, it changes. And there are 64 ambient lights for you to um, select from. Okay, my favorite is, of course, blue. And, well, I think in your life, maybe you'll just have three or four colors. Lah. But 64 colors is a lot. Well, you can choose your own. So inside here, you have a wireless charger. The wireless charger also comes with a cooler. Uh, it's got a fan here to keep your battery and your phone cool then you have your buttons here driving modes i think there are a few driving modes no smart key so the key is not here but i think you have your eco your sport uh, and other driving modes not too sure uh, aircon controls here your drink holder and also a little cubby hole here and this one has got air conditioning some of the aircon uh, air is directed here so you can use this as a drink chiller and the seats are really nice uh, they are sort of like bucket or semi bucket and they hold you quite well of course controls are electric and it's a built-in headrest and of course up here is the bonus it's a sunroof and the sunroof can be open Okay, the key is not in here, so it's not open. And so uh, there's also a sunshade. The sunshade is mechanical or rather manual. And the sunroof is with electrical control. Right, so let's take a quick look in the back. Oh yes, there. I think there are six airbags. Okay, the sound system is muted to be very good. We can't turn it on now. But there are eight speakers and they are Sony. As usual, the floor in EVs are a little bit higher because all the batteries are down at the floor. And whilst we're talking about the batteries, these are blade-type batteries and they are muted to be safer than uh, normal lithium-ion. They showed us a video where they actually ran this car over an obstacle, a very hard metal object, and the casing or the seal for the battery pack remain intact so this car is uh muted to be safer than others that means cherry is very committed to safety okay so in terms of the rear leg room this is a b slash c segment vehicle this seat is adjusted to my normal driving position and it is a little bit on the small side and this is because the floor is higher so I have to sit a bit higher but for uh, Malaysian sized people it's okay there are actually three seats at the back with a center armrest so as usual uh, the contours are made for two people and for three people at the squeeze of course there are belts for three people you have isofix points and also headrest for everybody headroom okay for my average height 164 mm I still have about five to six inches of headroom so it's adequate there's a aircon vent for the rear passengers and over here you have a usb and a usb c so the door design here has got a kind of a metal inlay and this is one of the tweeters here uh, it's contoured nicely and it i like this two-tone effect so they actually have yeah this is real stitching so it looks pretty good and of course you see here this is the ambient light and it gives the interior of the car a very nice tone for you. Uh, and of course, blue to me is always a very calming tone. And if you want to be aggressive, you can have it in red or yellow or whatever you want. Uh, and also, they also have green, purple, 64 colors. Take your pick. So at the back, you have this mini spoiler and of course, a wiper. And here's a little lip here and the boot is electric of course and the seats clearly do split and fold there's a tonio cover here which is a solid piece 
and it's tight here you can take it off if you want yeah so this is this helps to raise the tonneau cover and uh, inside here there is another compartment here for you to keep little stuff and your jack and everything i don't think no there is look at this there is actually a there's actually a place for a spare tire if you want a spare tire so this is always available for you to put a space saver and in which case you will want to remove this and the tire will be here and then this cover will be on top it will fit here nicely yes this cover will fit here nicely and so you can have a spare tire if you want if you don't you have your tire repair kit this is it so this is is the cherry tire sealer inflator oh it inflates too okay guys so that's our very quick walk around for the cherry omoda e5 in conjunction with the launch the price remember 146 800 and of course you can book your car at any cherry outlet there are 40 of them in the country, but if you want them from YSCong, go to shop.yskongdriving.com or send me a WhatsApp 016-335-0609 and we'll get your car to you super quick. Thanks for watching and till we meet again, bye-bye.